Every hero has an origin story. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 5 facts about Professor Marston and the Wonder Women. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're looking at everything we know about this biographical drama set to be released in the US in October 2017. The world can't stop us. Number 5. It's about the inspiration for Wonder Woman. I used to want to save the world. Considering the critical and box office success of the 2017 live action version of Wonder Woman, directed by Patty Jenkins and starring Gal Gadot, it should come as no surprise that the classic comic book character has seen a resurgence in popularity. This film will look at how the symbol of feminine power was created, and the inspiration creator Dr. William Moulton Marston took from the women he was surrounded by in real life. He used the nom de plume Charles Moulton to publish his works, but eventually the details of his real life were revealed. Who's Charles Moulton? That is my pseudonym. Number 4. It stars Luke Evans. A person is most happy when they are submissive to a loving authority. Luke Evans isn't quite a household name, but his filmography has only become more impressive in the early 21st century. He's played a wide variety of villains, including Gaston in the live-action adaptation of Disney's Beauty and the Beast, and Owen Shaw in Fast and Furious 6. It's a good story, isn't it? Of course, he's also played his fair share of heroic characters, such as Bard the Bowman in Peter Jackson's The Hobbit trilogy. In this film, Evans takes center stage as the man that created one of fiction's most heroic characters. Professor Marston didn't have any superpowers, but if his creation proved anything, it's that nothing is more powerful than the written word. What would happen if Wonder Woman's secret identity was revealed? Everything would be lost. Number 3. Dr. William Marston invented more than just Wonder Woman. William Marston may be known for the prolific feminist hero he created, but in fact, it's debatable what his most significant contribution to society is. Not only did he conceive of the idea of Wonder Woman, he is also considered to be one of the inventors of the lie detector test. His work studying blood pressure changes led him to develop an early version of the polygraph test, which worked as a systolic blood pressure test. Don't be surprised if this tidbit of information pops up in Professor Marston and the Wonder Women. It might not be the lasso of truth, but close enough. Have you ever watched pornographic videos? Number 2. It's directed by Angela Robinson. It can never happen. The world won't let it. Not to be confused with the actress of the same name, Angela Robinson is a prolific writer, producer, and director, who has done much of her work on television but also has some notable film credits. As a member of the LGBTQ community herself, Robinson has focused much of her work on properties that addressed homosexuality, like her 2003 short film and eventual full-length film Debs and the popular show The L Word. As you'll see in our number one entry, alternative relationships are a major theme of this film. So it seems that Robinson will be a great fit. I think you long for an unconventional life. Number one, it looks at a polyamorous relationship. Poly from the Greek meaning many, and amory from the Latin meaning loves. So many loves. Polyamory and non-monogamy have been hot topics in the news and pop culture in the new millennium. And Professor Marston and the Wonder Women will address them head on. Marston took part in a non-traditional relationship for years between his wife and Olive Byrne, an academic and former student of his. This part of his personal life will be the main focus of the movie's plot, along with the fact that Wonder Woman was inspired by both of the women in his life. She'll break your heart. You'll be jealous. I'm your wife, not your jailer. Their feminist leanings form the basis of his concept, and they are both retroactively credited for being figures that Wonder Woman was based on. Is this what you really want. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day.